Excellent lighting, my dude. It's been a minute. Um, what a crazy summer I've had. It's not really, look, it's not like it's been a crazy summer. It's just, I've been busy. Just living life, just doing my thing, you know. I uh, still don't get paid for my YouTube channel. Still salty for that. But not enough to want to keep not uploading videos. What have I been doing all summer? Just hella Assassin's Creed. Just hella. I did all of Black Flag. I did Freedom Cry even. I did Rogue. I'm working on Unity right now. Kind of been taking a break from Unity. Because uh, I've been doing some other shit. This is a stand-up desk. I made this. This has been like a, like a one month-ish project, like a, a month and a half long project. I'm standing up right now and I'm six foot two. So just I just want you guys to picture how big this desk is. Look at my PC just being a workhorse as she always is. But yeah, this is my desk. So this desk is roughly about 48 inches tall for a six foot two dude. And that's not the thing that took forever with this project. This is not what took forever. That is what took forever with this project. This is a chair that accompanies a stand-up desk. Yeah, you heard me right. I did some extensive research on, you know, like, what was the benefit of using a stand-up desk versus using a sit-down, uh, you know, just using a normal desk where you sit down in a chair. Spoiler alert, I've been visiting the chiropractor for the past five, I think six months now. Um, all summer long, which is another thing. I, I've just been doing that so often that I haven't really had time to like sit down and make a video like this. My chiropractor tells me sitting down is the devil's favorite activity. As a matter of fact, I told him that. Dr. Sean, you can use that whenever you want. Um, but I made, I made this stand-up desk hoping that it was just going to solve all my problems, that I wasn't going to have any more back issues um, from just sitting down, playing video games, making beats, whatever I plan on doing on this computer. But standing up in one spot is also just not fun. It hurts your lower back, or at least it hurts mine. Um, like I, I was literally just doing like I was just doing like the pee pee dance, just trying to like keep myself moving so my back didn't hurt. I wasn't having it. And then I came across a video about something on Kickstarter. It's a you know it's like a project, so it's not like an official product yet. It's just a project on Kickstarter, and it was called the Lean Chair. Prolonged sitting is one of the worst things you can do to your body. So like a lot of people, I went out and got a standing desk, and it was awesome for about an hour. And then I discovered what a lot of other people have discovered. Standing up in one place for a long time is hard on you. Not just physically, but the pain and restlessness actually makes it hard to focus and concentrate. Now, it only costs $200 to get a chair where you lean, where basically you just lean back. And that's it. That's all you do. It's like a, you're just standing up, but it changes your center of gravity so that it doesn't hurt your lower back as much. And, um, you know, whenever you, you ever just notice you're standing around, you're just sitting there standing in one spot, like at a party or something, either you move around and you go like, you just go and like lean on something just cause leaning, oh, dude, leaning just feels so good. I'm just leaning against this chair. The point is, uh, this was only a Kickstarter project. People from like four years ago still haven't received their chairs. They paid for it or donated, whatever you call it. They supported it and they still haven't gotten their chairs. Now, I'm not I'm not saying not to support this guy's Kickstarter because I'm not going to lie. The chairs that he makes, like the leaning chairs, are like just absolutely just epic and badass. All right. But people were waiting for four years. I wasn't about to wait in that same line. So I decided, fuck it. Me... Being the woodworker that I've always have been pretty much, I decided to make my own leaning chair. Um, it looks as shitty as about a lo as long as it took me to make. In other words, the one that the guy makes is like top notch. Like that is top notch. And this is like some, I don't even know. This is like some just, just, <laughs> oh my God. I just kind of want to walk you guys through the construction of this thing. Um, I, these are like two of the just ugliest holes that I've ever made in my entire life. Like I, those are the ugliest drilled holes that I've ever had to make, but they, they serve a purpose. There is a screw here and a screw here. Um, to start, I guess I'll start with the obvious thing. This is the ass cushion that I used to, you know, fart in all the time with my other chair. So these four holes were for the, were for the screws that fit into here now like i said this is the ass cushion so this is obviously where that would have gone and the armrest that's all the way over there in the corner huh, 
Yeah, don't mind that dirty ass pile of clothes there. I just haven't done laundry yet. But yeah, that right there, I don't know how I didn't know how I was gonna put that onto my chair right here. So I decided to go with the ass cushion instead. Now that was literally the last step that I did, but it's obvious it's the most obvious part of the chair. So I started off with two big pieces of plywood just like this one, going down on this side and then going down on this side as well. I spent most of my part with the math. The math of this was honestly the hardest part. I actually had to remember trigonomic functions to be able to figure out like exactly how tall I wanted this thing to be. You know, you had to make like a right triangle going down. So like this was obviously or 180 degrees right here. Blah, 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 blah. I just needed to figure out what angle to cut all these two by fours at that support this thing. So I started off with two big pieces of plywood that ran all the way down. And then I don't know what made me change my mind right here. But I instead decided to go with, instead of plywood, I went with two 2x4s. Two it just seemed sturdier to me. Same thing, I had to figure out the angle of the cut. Dude, so much math. This is like one of those scenarios where the math that you learn in high school is actually like somewhat useful. Especially when you're kind of a woodworker. Kind of, sort of. So then yeah, I just kind of put the 2x4s on there. Blah, 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 blah. More 2x4s down here and then I screwed a piece of plywood on top of it. You can't really see it. Excuse me, but this thing is just, uh, wow, it's already dirty. It's a piece of foam that I got from work. It's like super high density foam. You can actually get this, uh, I'm assuming at like a hardware store, or a fabric store, or some kind of material store. And then for the back, I just used a four by four as like a support. That's the standing chair. Now it's made of wood and I have hardwood floors, you can see. So I found this at uh, Menards, at Menards. You can find it probably at any other local hardware store. But this stuff was kind of perfect because it doesn't really slide. It's very frictionless. Like you can't slide it and uh, it'll protect the hardwood floor. And uh, yeah. So just to paint the image a little bit, I made this desk without thinking I was going to make this. So the desk, I am no stranger to making desks. My navy blue desk that I had for a while, I made that one. That one's easy. Like it was all easy. It's just time consuming, you know. Prepping it is the hardest part, and then you gotta like sand it, and then you gotta paint it and coat it and all that shit. So I made this desk, um, and then this time I didn't bother painting it at all, really. This is just masonite. Um, you can get masonite somewhere, I'm assuming. Don't ask me how I got mine. I think the health benefits of a stand-up desk far outweigh the, the uncomfortability that you'll have uh, at a sit down desk or the, just the damage that you're going to do to yourself when you just sit down all the time. Sitting down is the devil's favorite activity. I am going to get a patent on that. Nobody take that shit. Just like the guy on Kickstarter said, you know, he has a, he has a thing. He's like, because sitting kills and standing sucks. You're just sitting, standing up in one spot. Oh man, what could you do? Whatever could you possibly do? Don't mind that those dirty clothes that I keep showing you. What could I possibly do? I just don't feel like standing anymore. Oh. Oh. oh it's just so comfortable just leaning and holding this heavy-ass camera at a weird angle. Fuck. So if you guys want to know what I've been doing uh, all summer, it's kind of it's kind of what I've been doing. Kind of just, you know, living life. I got some GoPro footage from a canoeing trip that I did. I've been playing hella Assassin's Creed, like a lot of Assassin's Creed. Don't go anywhere, family. I have, uh... I have some more videos coming soon, or at least ideas of some that, you know. Dude, I can make videos whenever I want. STD, suck this dick. And um, yeah, thanks for watching this one. I hope you enjoyed it. Ooh, this chair is so comfortable. And this high density foam is just fantastic.